Hello, this is David Chung. Since I was a teenager, I prayed to God, send me all over the world to preach the gospel and make disciples of all nations. It was around AD 2000 that I had the hardest time in my entire life with some personal issues. I resigned the church I planted and served as pastor, joined Youth with a Mission to train for a missionary outreach. Throughout the training, I prayed, God, meet me one more time as you met me a few years ago and called me into ministry. Restore my heart and renew my call, otherwise I have no hope. Sure enough, God met me again while in training in that base in Colorado. Our team went to Ukraine for a missionary outreach, and while we were serving there, the Lord spoke to my heart, David, you will have to work in this part of the world to help lead 500,000 people into the kingdom of God. I spoke to God, God, you got the wrong man, I'm not a Billy Graham. But I heard the Lord strongly laying emphasis or laying impression upon my heart, David, training 500 pastors to be able to reach out to 1,000 people respectively comes to 500,000 people. With that clear call, our ministry was over and we came back to the United States. And then I went home in Texas and a couple long friends of mine invited me and, he, and their friends to dinner once. We had a nice dinner, we had a wonderful fellowship, and they handed me a huge amount of money and said, David, we want you to start your own international outreach in use of this money. That's how DCMI got started as an, as an international outreach ministry. Now the now, scope of our ministry reaches beyond Eastern Europe and the former Soviet Union countries. Literally now God is sending us all over the world including Africa and Asia. I would love to invite you to join us in reaching out to the people of these countries where Christian churches need lots of input from without. Would you be willing to partner with us? to reach out to the people of these countries. God bless you. Hallelujah! 
Abari muri stade mu kumara imana bashi cyane. Jesus is in your life now. Ubu manda ho ndagira ngabwire mwe bari hano. Sumen Pirewa Made Yahapote Pirewa Machi Vite Swaminge Kunen Pirewa Why was Jesus so effective? Number one, because Jesus saw the world from God's eye. Number two, because he had compassion for suffering people. Number three, his ministry was powerful because he learned to pray before the Almighty God.